Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Dear students, thank you very much for joining me in today's session. My name is Hamid Askar and on behalf of Institute of Freelancing, I welcome you all. Uh, last time in our previous session, we discussed about the introduction uh, of uh, CorelDRAW and today we are going to discuss the interface of uh, CorelDRAW or the workspace of CorelDRAW. Uh, when it, you compare this uh, CorelDRAW interface with uh, Photoshop, or Adobe Illustrator, it is, it is a little bit different as compared to them. Like in overall, the screen size or the environment that remains the same. Let me uh, close the quick start screen uh, by clicking allow show and welcome screen at launch. Just click uncheck. And if you're interested to keep on uh, coming again and again, every time you open CorelDRAW, so you have to check them on. And if you don't need that, just check them off and close from here. And here we go. Now, next time when you open the cold draw, uh, hopefully this will not appear again. As Photoshop and uh, any other application, this is called the tools. And with the help of these tools, you can create anything, correct? The top is the file menu. Here is the version. I have just downloaded the older version of CorelDRAW. It's an evaluation version, by the way. And you can purchase any of the version from Corel, as well as you can uh, download the 15 days trial version of the latest CorelDRAW, which is available to all of you uh, from uh, CorelDRAW.com, which is the official website of CorelDRAW. And from there, here's the file menu. You can create anything from these menus as we do not have created any of the documents. So probably all the menus are not available right now. And further, depending upon these uh, tools, these, uh, the properties of those panels will be changed. And as compared to Adobe Illustrator and Adobe Photoshop, this right panel is entirely different. It is fixed for the color palettes. The default color palette is this, whereas you can customize, you can change this according to your requirement. So just click outside and it will be wipe out and just clicking at the bottom uh, uh, to open it up. Uh, in this way, you can open up any of the color palette and Joby Apka document create hoga, Joby Apka artwork hoga, usme you can place any type of color from here, pick any type of color from here and just click outside this and it will be wiped out. So how to start? Let me create a new document first and the create new document palette appears. The first thing which I'll ask is the name of the document. So let me start with, uh, with any of the name and the destination is the default destination. And by the way, you can uh, reset and you can change the default destination of the Coral Draw at any time. Hum, by default, abhi iske size ko letter pe hi rakhenge, and we will not going to change the height and width. And by default, this is something which is very critical. And this will actually allows you to understand the height and width of the document which you are going to create. Uh, either in the inches, millimeters, points, pixels, feet, yards, miles, centimeters, meters, kilometers, and jo bhi aapko more appropriate, more suitable like to understand at the later stage inside the document, you have to pick from uh, the first stage here. So let me pick up the inches and the uh, height and width will remain the same. Whereas the portrait or the landscape, that is the uh, definition which you have to uh, pick initially from here. Uh, let me pick up the portrait as default and uh, let me click OK to get it started. As soon as you click, here we go. The first document uh, with your name, as you mentioned, the name of the document in the start that has been uh, opened up. So now, as you can see, the layout of the menus that has been changed because after creating this document, there are plenty of things which will be available to all of you. All the tools which were initially unavailable, now they are available because you are trying to create something on your artboard on your this letter size document. So for example, as we did earlier in PowerPoint, as well as in Photoshop, as well as in Adobe Illustrator, the initial tools that might be a circle, that might be a rectangle, a circle, a polygonal, or any other shape. 
first let me pick up any of the tool for example let me pick up the rectangle and then let me pick up the circle and after this let me pick up hexagonal polygonal star and as you can see in the bottom of every tool there is a triangle which is available which is showing that it's a group of tools available you have to click it for more than a second and it will appear right the default is the top one and all remainings will be available depending upon your uh, click depending upon your clicks available so other than that the square circle uh, polygonal here is the basic shape tools which are all as we have seen in the powerpoint as well as in photoshop as well as in adobe illustrator the same comes uh, with the coral draw also so just clicking on these basic shapes uh, you can uh, create any type of basic shapes and then you can amend and as you can see from clicking here you can click on any of these shape and later you can amend this according to your requirement right so as i have selected the basic shape of this set and instead of this, let me pick up the arrow. And here is the group of arrow, which is available. There are plenty of shapes, ready-made shapes, which are available. Lakin, you can, uh, at any time, you can change this to any other. Ab aapne yahan se aage kya kar raha hai? First and foremost, you have to select this one. So a uh, selection of any other uh, element, you have to pick the first tool and that is the pick tool. In the Photoshop, that is a move tool. In Adobe Illustrator, that's a selection tool. In uh, Coral Draw, it's a pick tool. So you have to pick and you have to press the delete while clicking on the delete button on your keyboard, right? So for example, let me delete this one also because we are going to experiment with first and two basic shapes, the rectangle, square, on the circle so for example let me pick up uh, the rectangle and as i told you earlier the basic uh, aspects the basic things which are related to this as you jaise hi aap isko pick karenge jo bhi tool aap draw karne ke baad usko pick karenge the properties panel of this is going to be changed according to the uh, selection of the tool. For example, I select circle. Here you can see the height width will remain the same, whereas it, it should be an ellipse complete close. It's an it should be a pi one. It should be a arc one. Kis ka hoga? You have to select this, this, and this, and that's how this goes on. So let me select this one first, and as you can see, the rounded corner or the uh, scrapped corner or chamfered corner kis tarah ka aapne karna hai that is something you have to select here and is ki taraf hum thoda sa baad mein aayenge first let me give you a little bit brief that how can you modify how can you update this basic shape so here is the 1 2 3 and 3 6 plus 2 8 and one is the center 9 from going to the center and picking up center you can move it anywhere around first to remember then you can select any of the corner and diagonal movement ke liye you can either to this direction or to this direction or to this direction you can and make it extended make it short just be size pe aap isko karna chahe, that is something you can extend then these are the four corners and we discuss about the center point five things we have discussed now let's come to the center parts of uh, agar aap isko vertical up and down karna chahte hain, that is something available and if you want to move from here here is you can move it around or even though you can cross it and you can bring it something like this right so that is the uh, vertical movements and then same goes to the horizontal movement aap is se isko, you can make it uh, bigger as well as smaller just be size ka jadar bhi aap isko karna chahi that is something now the final the last thing jo ke is pe discuss karne wali that is the uh, how can i rotate any of the shape so simply just click on either center or iske kisi bhi jaga ke upar aake the bounding boxes ke under not the outside first time you have to select that is for the pick and then again select for the rotation Achari. Ab rotation mein kya hoga? 
there is certainly there are different things. One is if you go with the corners, it will be exactly like this, right? And if you go with this, that's a skew option, correct? So usi rotation ke under that is something for different purpose, and this is for something different purpose. So I hope it makes sense. Let me undo this and let me do it again uh, to all of viewers. If you want to zoom it, there are multiple ways to zoom. First, you can press the Z on the keyboard and let's zoom it a little bit more. And that is just to give you another idea that now you can closely observe it. Right? So, First, as you can see, click it will give you the options to rotate either from the corners, any of the corners, but these are not the corners. These are the center points. Center points say you can uh, you can move it like this way to any of the direction. Correct? So it is all up to your creativity. document create karna For example, I'm interested. Ke is ki shape dusri ban jai. So very easily you can do it. Let me undo this because right now we are interested in the very basic shape or uski movement ko hum discuss karna Correct? So that is the first tool, pick tool or pick tool key different options. So uh, I hope it makes sense. It is very much clear to all of you. Hum agle wale session mein ab hum discuss karenge how to further modify it uh, with the second tool that is the shape tool shape ko modify kis tarike se karna hai so uh, after this session hum agle session agli video mein wo cheez discuss karenge